I was able to make it to our charity rummage and take all three kiddos. I've got the littlest on the floor right now. He's playing with a few of the items too. But I'm going to share my haul with you. Very spring-esque, um, spring farmhouse cottage style decor and some spring clothing, which I'll insert try-ons and also how I've used the pieces in my home. So let's go rummaging first. <laughs> this Christmas yeah. stuff. Yeah. So much Christmas. The clothing selection at this charity rummage is all sorts of things. You get some stained, you get some beautiful name brand things. It's just everything in one big space. This is like a bread basket. Look at this gray basket. No. It looks like it, huh? Oh, this one's kind of cool. Uh, little one. Oh, this one's fun. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, this. Oh, this one's for. The dishware aisles can always be hit and miss, so this time it did not feel like it was as well stocked with pieces I enjoy. I'm sure many people have found some beautiful items that they want, but you know, I did pick up a few pieces, but nothing that I thought was super or that I really needed. enjoy looking at plates and platters any secondhand store that I go to I did end up picking these two blue ones up they were just adorable cute great for putting under plants for decorating with and then these little um, crystal I don't know what they are I guess or would, would be really cute with um, a single bud in them or something and then I did look at all their faux flowers they had quite a bit there but nothing that really caught my eye and frames were also a little sparse and there were some cute things but just nothing that I felt I really needed or wanted to bring home. This little candle holder was super cute. I probably would have spray painted if I took it. And then these wall hanging candle holders I really debated on but did not end up taking those either. And of course, I always look for little crocs, big crocs, any size croc, but I did not get that as well. All right, let's just start off with the decor pieces. I found two baskets, and if you don't know, the charity rummage is fill a bag for $5, or it is 50 cents an item. So either way, it's a great steal. So I have an idea of what I want to do with these. I am using them in my food storage, long-term food storage or food pantry in our unfinished basement. So just have been looking for baskets on the cheap and this is the base, best way to do it is rummage sales and thrift stores. And then this beautiful basket with a little handle. Um, so this one I've been storing like my dry beans in their bags and then this one I had our onions and garlic in. So, um, I will share that with you with how it looks. Okay, next are two plates. If you saw, I did see some very beautiful plates, some pretty flower false graph plates. I thought those would be gorgeous, but I am intentional with what I bring into my home, as many of you know. So, even though I may want it, I hold myself back. 
These are very pretty plates. This one says Camwood Ivory, made in the USA, um, Universal Cambridge, something like that. So it's a little weathered looking, but these will go under some plants or I put my dish soap on it or like my scrubby brush. Um, but under plants inside the home, having vintage looking plates is really a fun way to go. And this one says edge. I can't read it very well. Um, it's just, maybe you can see that on the back. There's a little bit of engraving there. And then it also says Gordon right down here, but there's a chip in it, but you know, under a plant what can go wrong with these blue and white or cream since they're worn looking plates. All right, hats. I have a hat wall in my bedroom and I thought, why not find a few more? Um, I had five up there and then these make it seven. So I decided to try these out and I'm not sure I'm really liking it with both of them up. This one's really dented on the top, but maybe I can reshape it. Little guy was playing with the plates on the floor. Um, anyways, I just thought these would be really cute on the hat wall or who knows maybe I'd wear them uh -uh. <laughs> sun hats are better but anyways can't pass these up okay my kiddos also picked out a few things so everything I got was seven dollars um, I'm not going to show you everything they got I grabbed a few books for them and then they picked out a few little knick-knacky toys and one of them found a pair of crocs they wanted so um, when it's that cheap you know, some of the things you might just toss later, it's okay to pick them up. All right, first shirt. This is a Time and True. I really like Walmart brand Time and True items. I have a green sweatshirt just like this. It is a medium, which is a little big, but this lavender purple color, mm, so pretty. And I thought very springy to have. And then just a, a new day tank top. Um, these will go nice under long sleeves or under a jean jacket or just to wear because it's springtime and it's starting to warm up. It's finally 65 today. So tank tops are nice when you're working out in the garden as well. This green button down is gorgeous. I really thought this was so pretty with the cuffed sleeve. For, it's nursing friendly. What is the brand here? Middle shop, I guess is what it's called. So um, we're just really pretty, very flowy. I tuck it in the front. You could tuck it in all around, but I just thought this was a really nice springy shirt to have and would be great underneath a sweater or just all by itself. And then a jean jacket. Jean jackets are in right now and these just go well with everything. You can do jean pants and a jean jacket, um, a skirt and a jean jacket, a dress and jean jacket. It's just a go-to. This brand is Faded Glory, so I think that was Walmart a while ago, but just really nice jean jacket. It's a little more boxy than I wanted, but I still thought I would snatch that up. Then I'm gonna insert two shirts that I picked up um, Amazon actually um, one I think is a no-go because it just didn't look quite right under the arms I like the cinching on the ends and it's really lightweight but it just really poofed out on the arms I guess and was too saggy and didn't look didn't look quite right so um, this brand was Dakotu so I did find that on Amazon, but I will probably be returning that one. And then this blue button down, or, or a quarter button down with three quarter length sleeves. I thought this baby blue was really pretty. This brand was the Amazon Essentials brand. And so I just, I felt like I needed to update my wardrobe. I told my husband, a lot of my clothes, uh, this is my third postpartum, they just get worn out and I haven't really done like an overhaul and an update in quite a while. I'll have to do that in the fall for my fall winter stuff because I realized sweaters get pilling and stinky and spilled on and stained on and so springtime overhaul with some clothing stuff for myself is sometimes important. 
Okay, that wasn't much, but there were some beautiful things to be seen at this rummage, and I'm glad you got to come along. And thanks for sharing this haul with me and this video. I will talk with you guys in the next one.